Now to the very latest developments on the homicide investigation out of Cranston. Police have arrested a man in connection with the murder of Shirley Donnelly. Donnelly's family says the 38-year-old was found beaten to death inside her Diaraf apartment early Friday morning. Eyewitness News reporter Marilyn Shearer has the latest details from the West Bay Mobile Newsroom. We spoke with family members who tell us they got word of the arrest late Thursday night from police. They tell us they knew who it was all along. Family of homicide victim 38-year-old Shirley Donnelly stand in the rain Saturday night holding vigil for their loved one. They say they are relieved to learn Cranston police arrested a man responsible for her death. We always knew who it was. Which was? The one that was living with the... Her boyfriend? Her boyfriend. Donnelly's body was found inside her burned-out Dyer Avenue apartment Thursday. Police say the suspect intentionally set the fire to cover up the murder of Donnelly. Her family say they knew the suspect and did not like him and that Donnelly was the victim of abuse. They say the suspect was released from prison just a few days ago. We knew, because mm -hmm. you just know, like, the look on their face. She's terrified, she's scared. We'd offer her and Shirley get away from her, come stay with us. Police labeled the circumstances surrounding Donnelly's death inside her Riverbend apartment suspicious. Family members What's say Donnelly, who was beaten to death, was a loving mother of three. We know that the killer of my cousin is in prison. Mm -hmm. so. so you feel a sense of closure? A little bit, yes. We can't bring her back, but at least her justice has prevailed for her. Police have yet to identify the suspect, who family members tell us is expected to be arraigned Monday morning. Family members also say they know it's too late for Donnelly, but they hope other victims of domestic violence reach out and get help. Reporting with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom, Marilyn Shera, Eyewitness News.